Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are brand new here and you're just finding me. My name is Olivia and I would love it if you wanted to stick around a while, hit the red subscribe button down below, join my channel. Uh, thank you so much for being here for today's video, you guys. I'm really excited to share with you a pretty big Zara haul. I went and grabbed a big bag of Zara jeans to share with you guys today and I'm excited to try them on. I do have to say, however, Zara jeans, Zara denim in general is a really big blind spot for me and I am someone who has kind of mastered the curvy jean. I found a really good um, go-to jean. I know my little VIPs, my little MVPs that really work for my body type and I'm excited to share that with you guys today, like what my experience is with Zara denim. If you are someone who has a curvy body type, I have bigger hips, I have a smaller waist, but I have a lot of thigh to work with and I'm definitely on the curvy midsize spectrum. I am somewhere in between a size 12 and sometimes a size 10. It really depends on the fit, it depends on the style, so I'm looking forward to trying these with you. I haven't even tried one pair on, so getting a complete raw and first time try on with all of this Zara denim, so fingers crossed, at least one works, like let's hope. But before we get into the video today, I do want to thank Anna Luisa for sponsoring this part of the video. Anna Luisa is a jewelry brand, an upscale high-end jewelry brand that is affordable and also very sustainable, and I've been wearing them for almost over a year. No over a year. I love their jewelry and I actually wear the hoops all the time. If you are over on my Instagram and you see the hoops that I wear, it is Anna Luisa. I love them. But their quality of jewelry is exceptional. It's going to last you a long time, uh, but you're also going to feel good when you buy it because of how sustainable it is. Uh, so I think all of their jewelry ranges from some more affordable um, jewelry to things up a little bit on the higher end, but there is something for everybody, and especially with the holidays coming up. Black Friday, they have some incredible sales, and I will link all of the items that I have down below for you guys to go and check out. So just starting out with the first pair that I'm wearing here. These are the Nikki hoop earrings and they are stunning. So I don't know if you guys can see, you know, pretty close up here. They're just a really pretty uh, 14 karat gold earring and I absolutely think they are so pretty. They're kind of delicate, but then they have that little bit of like chunkiness to them that makes them stand out. So I really love these. The other pair that I picked up are called Farina and they are almost like a super delicate style. They have this half moon shape and I absolutely love this pouch by the way. It's really helpful to keep your jewelry in and safe and secure. Um, but they are 14 karat gold as well. They have these little little diamonds in there. Well, they're, they're cubic zirconia, but right here, like they're super colorful and pretty. So I love these. They are gonna look so good with everything. They're super, I just like feminine, petite. Like I really like the look of these, but they still stand out. And then my favorite piece is the necklace. It's the Suryaz necklace. It's a little butterfly. Look how pretty this is. So again, um, it comes in this really, actually I'll put it like this so you guys can see a little bit better. So it comes in this really pretty neutral nude pouch, but look at how gorgeous and delicate this little butterfly is. I love it so much. Their prices start at $39 and they have some incredible Black Friday deals, so definitely go and check them out. I will link everything down below for you guys, but I just love them as per usual. They always, always impress me every time I try something new from them. So without further delay, let's get into today's Zara denim try on haul. Okay, so just so it makes it easy, I'm gonna wear the same bodysuit for the whole video. Um, this bodysuit I actually got from Zara as well. It's this gorgeous, it's actually coming up a little bit more blue on camera. I would still say it's like a cornflower blue, but it's a little bit even more purple in real life and it's ribbed. It's really pretty. Um, I have it on a size extra large, by the way. So I have a little bit of space here. Sometimes I'd like it to be even a little bit more form-fitting, but it's super pretty. Square neckline, well, like a scooped square neckline. And then just keeping it super real and raw with you guys, I am also wearing my Spanx underwear. Um, so this is, and I wear these in a size medium. They have a little bit of compression in the tummy, which is nice. And yeah, this is what I'm wearing. I'm just keeping it very real with you guys. Um, we'll start out with the very first pair and I'm gonna try them on 
on camera because I want you guys to see what my experience is like. So I got these ones. These are the Zara straight blue jeans. They are size 44 US 12. So I wasn't sure what I would be in terms of sizing. So I went with the 12 and most of them just in case because a lot of people say with Zara like they're not forgiving and there's like there's no stretch. Um, so they look like this. And they have an unfinished hem at the bottom, a raw hem. And at the back, this is the detail I really liked, they have like a little white leather patch. So guys, I'm just going to try them on. I'm just going to try it on on camera. And uh, oh, they have a button fly. I didn't even know that. Okay, I'm going to try them on because you guys need to see the actual fit. Okay. All right, well, I have them up. Okay, we're gonna do up the, so I'm just gonna do up the button fly. Really glad I got the 12, fits really well. Okay, a little jump to wiggle them into place. I actually really like these. Wait a minute, hold up, wait a minute. These are kinda nice, very, very stiff. Okay, let me pull you guys down so you guys can see. Okay, I just pulled you guys down so you can actually see the full jean. So there is no stretch in these. Um, they definitely have a high rise. They're coming up above my belly button, which I really love. Super, super stiff. So I can definitely say you got to go true to size, and I think 12 is really good. The only thing is, I don't know if you can tell, but we have a lot of the gapping in the back, which for me, ugh, I really get disappointed with that because I really want it to, like I mentioned, I want it to fit and form uh, to my curves and not have this going on. So that's where I feel like, you know, in the waist area, I'd probably be fine with like the 42, but I could not in the, in the thighs. Your gal has thighs that need to have some room. And so these are actually pretty cute. Length for me, they're coming actually pretty long. They're a little like they're definitely an ankle length, but they're not cropped in any way. I would wear ankle boots with these, and I actually think it would look very, very like a cool girl kind of look. I like the button fly, but you can't see it, which sometimes I really think that's the point is to have like a button fly on show. Okay, so out of like, I don't know. I'm gonna rate out of 10. Um, seven out of 10 for these guys. Let me know what you guys think down in the bottom below, um, in the comment section down below. Okay, I'm gonna move on to my second pair. Okay, so going into the next pair, I have the super elastic jeans. I have them in a black, and it's like a washed out black. And these ones, are, again, are in a size 44 or size 12. So they definitely feel stretchy. Like that's one of the first things I noticed. They are skinny, so they're more of that skinny fit. Um, let's try them on. So I can already tell, I can already tell they're very stretchy. Okay. Okay. Actually, I feel like I like these. Just right off the bat, they feel like more of even like a jegging type. Um, actually pretty good. They're comfortable, they feel like a second skin. Okay, so here are the jeans in their full form. I actually really like these. They are definitely a stretchy, elastic type of jean. They feel very like a jegging in a way, but a little bit thicker, so they still have that jean feel. They are very, very comfortable, and a skinny leg at the bottom. They also come up so high. I am loving the high waist of these. Really, really happy with that. Um, I'm pretty sure I saw these as well in a mid-rise and I almost feel like the mid-rise would still be pretty high. So in terms of fit, I feel like they fit so well on the thigh. They are definitely great size there, but in the actual waist, I have a lot of room and I don't feel held in. Like, do you know what I mean? If, I don't know if you guys can see, but like I just have all of this excess that doesn't make me feel like I'm held in or anything like that in the midsection. So I feel like that's gonna be my struggle is 
the fact that it's going to fit really nicely here, but it's going to be like a little bit off in the midsection. I'm going to give these guys an 8. I actually think that they're going to fit a lot of different body types really, really well. So, super cute. Make sure you guys get a view from the back. Okay, let's move on to the next pair. Okay, this next pair, I don't, I don't know why I picked them up in a size 42. I guess I wanted to try a size 10 just to see what it looks like. These are a slim jean. They look like this. They're like that really pretty um, lighter medium blue. I love the wash of these a lot. And then they are not super skinny at the bottom. They're a little bit slimmer, but not a full like straight. I'm nervous to put these on because I feel like size 10 in Zara jeans, girl. I don't know. Okay. Okay, so these are a slim jean and your girl must have been feeling slim when I picked up the 42 because 100% the wrong size. A 44 would have been better, but even still, the fit of these jeans is off. It is not a jean where I would feel excited to put it on. It's not a jean that fits and hugs the curves. It's a very straight jean. It is a mid-rise. It's coming just below or just around my belly button. And it just feels stiff, no stretch. Like maybe like the tiniest amount of stretch. Don't, these jeans to me make me feel like the feeling I used to get when trying on jeans when I was in like high school or like around then when I would just feel like disappointed and like jeans were just not for me. These are the ones, you know? The ones you find before you find those curvy mom American Eagle jeans. These are the ones. Okay, so if you can see from the full view, they don't look that bad from afar. They definitely, for me, they look too tight, um, but they are like they're conforming to, to my body and they're definitely holding me in. So we have all of that kind of going on and like they're not an awful, awful fit, but I just don't love them. But the fit for me is just kind of off in general. Like the, um, the rise of it is just a little bit too low. Um, they're a little too stiff. I think there is a specific body type that these are great for. But if you are curvy, if you are mid-size, if you are plus size, these are definitely a jean that are not gonna be a great choice. But anyway, let's move on to the next pair. Okay, so this pair is a 42 as well. But this one I feel a little bit more hopeful about in terms of the fit. These are the high rise uh, sculpt jeans. So they're in a size 42, like I mentioned, sorry. And they look like this. Now that I have them up, I'm like, they are a little bit snug looking. They are a medium wash blue, a skinny uh, ankle. They look like the bum, like the pockets on the bum are a little bit higher, which I find does give a lift look to the bum. And then I really like this really pretty beige patch of faded leather on the back, I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna put these on. Guys, pray for me. I feel like they're stretchy. Yes, yes. Oh, much better. You guys ever do the like bend and pull up? I feel like that really helps. There's a whole method and dance routine when you're putting on your jeans. The other thing I always do is I always grab the, um, the thigh region, pull the fabric, and then I kick out the leg. That's definitely a thing people do. Yeah, I'm really, really liking the fit of these. Um, they come up really nice and high. Uh, they're very lightweight though. Again, similar to a really lightweight jean, borderline jegging, but they're not as elastic. They do have a ton of stretch to them, but still good structure um, because they're holding me in. So I get the sculpting, you know, kind of a term that they're using for these jeans because they feel definitely like they're sculpting. I actually feel like I really like these. Excuse me, Zara. Okay, let me pull you down to show you the full length. Okay, so just pulled you guys down so you can see the full jean, and I really do like these. The reason I do really like these is definitely how high-waisted they come, and not only that, there is definitely a bit of control in the midsection. So I feel as though it is holding me in a little bit, and we are not getting any gapping. Look at the fit on the back, like it's still hugging me in the waist, but also just kind of like sculpting the bum area as well, which I really like. But I rate these. I gotta say, 
I feel like these deserve like an eight. They're a very, very good fit. Okay, let's move on to the next pair. Okay, so we are finishing off with a pair that I will not lie, I have very high hopes for because they are a mom jean. I did find these in the sales section, so if I can link them, I will, but that's where I found mine. I got these in a size 44, and they are like a washed out black mom jean look. And you can see at the bottom, they're definitely a wider ankle. They have like the slightest bit of distressing at the, um, the hem and yeah, I'm excited to try these on. They feel like a very good quality denim. I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope these work out. Let's, let's put them on. So far so good. Okay. No struggle with these whatsoever. They're going up very nicely. I do really like these. I know mom is meant to be like more of that relaxed fit. Um, I think that there is a little excess for me, especially right here. I don't know if you guys can tell. That's something that drives me crazy with jeans if uh, they don't fit nicely in the midsection and they bunch. I just don't feel like it looks that good, um, but they come up nice and high. So do we overlook that? And in the back, I love the patch again. Like these are pretty nice. Let me give you a full view. Okay, so here are the mom jeans full view. I do think that they are pretty relaxed. Um, and that is definitely a mom style jean to have that little bit more relaxed fit. But there is a lot of extra fabric in the midsection here. So no kind of tummy control really. But they do come up high. So I am getting a slight bit of um, control just at the top here. Um, but let me turn around, show you the back. Okay, so here is the back. So they're coming up nice and high, but there's no holding me in. There's a little bit of gapping happening. Uh, and then the more, like when I move to, to just turn around to the back, they fall down a little bit. I do like them. It's just right here that's kind of driving me crazy because when I move, it just feels like so much extra fabric. And I don't know if that's like translating on camera, but there's definitely a lot of excess here. But for a mom jean, maybe that works. I'm gonna go ahead and give these guys a seven just because they're not ticking off all the boxes I really like in jeans to like up it to an eight, but they are pretty good, very affordable, and yeah, overall they really do um, have a nice fit. So, pretty cute. Okay, so that is gonna do it for this Zara denim try on haul and I really had low expectations and I came out feeling like it wasn't a complete flop like I had actually a few pairs of jeans where I felt really good in them I think those sculpt jeans are my favorite the ones that have that good stretch but also some of that good structure that's gonna hold you in and sculpt your curves and we love that here so I think those are my number one but I do also really like these mom jeans I do feel like for the price the quality is great um, I'm impressed so I think overall I still am no expert when it comes to Zara denim I think that that um, does intrigue me to continue to try them and see what other styles they might have which leads me just to ask you guys if you have any suggestions down below of other Zara specific jeans that might be really great on a curvy body please let me know also let me know if you want me to try any other jean brands or just brands that have jeans that you want me to take a look at and try them on just so I can share them with you so Hopefully this video was helpful for you guys if you um, are looking for jeans and you're interested in Zara and you just never knew what they fit like. But um, yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed watching. Please let me know which one was your favorite down below. I love to hear from you guys down in the comments. If you haven't already and you enjoyed this video, please do remember to give this video a big thumbs up. It really helps out me and it helps out my channel. And of course, please remember to hit that red subscribe button down below Join my channel. I post lots and lots of different videos. So if you're interested in checking out my channel, definitely head over uh, and check out some of my videos over there. I'm also over on Instagram at Olivia Frida Curves over there, and that's listed in the description box down below. And don't forget to check out Anna Luisa Jewelry and their Black Friday sale going on right now. Go and check them out. You will not be disappointed. They have beautiful, gorgeous jewelry, and I definitely can't recommend it enough. So thanks again for watching guys. I appreciate it. I hope you are having the best day wherever you are and uh, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Bye.